Hey everyone, uh, I'm back with another Mystery Girl video, you know, the Funko Pops, the figures I collect. Um, if, if I feel a little bit tired during this video, I was just cleaning my room. Uh, it, it was a lot of work, let me be honest. But you can see the yellow bins behind me. I had to stack all my Funkos and those, and it still didn't fit them all. But, um, oh boy. But, uh, I was holding off on opening these, but I said screw it. Because I want to make room in, in my room. So, I might as well open these and just put these figures with the rest. But, um, it's the Black Friday double box. At least for this year. Because, um, I think I've seen some videos of people doing the 2021 version. Uh, I haven't seen anybody open this version. All I heard was that the Funko Shop one that they had was really shitty. Like, that was the bad Black Friday box, apparently. But we're going to try this Mystery Girl thing. There's four boxes. Each of them have two in it. I, it could vary. I don't. I, it could vary from anything at this point. I'm looking for anything stickered, as you guys know, because those are more valuable. Um... I'll put the prices down below. In my last video, I know I said I was going to put the price, but the pop figure didn't show up in the app, so I couldn't put nothing down there for anything. But if it ever does come up, I'll, hopefully I remember and I'll do it. But um, we got the first box here. I don't know. Should I do this in the four different videos? I could. I think I'm going to have to go down for dinner soon, too, so... But we'll break we'll break this up maybe into a couple parts. So we'll open one just to get a taste, just to see if this box is really worth something or not. Because I have a feeling it might not be, but we'll never know. So I'm looking for anything Marvel related. This was the first box that came out during the whole week that they had during Thanksgiving. They had the black light box that ended it all. They had a Marvel. Uh, shoot. I don't remember anything else, but there was a lot of them. But, um, here we go. I'm hoping it's something I can at least add to the collection. Not something that's, you know, not worth being in my collection. Ooh, I say that and it happened. So, we got Harry the Husky. Apparently, University of Washington? I, I, I must be smoking something because I don't know what the hell this is. I don't. It looks cool. I'll give it that. What is it, like a school mascot? Uh, Alright. Yay. Yeah, then I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do like a four-parter. So I'm not going to do it all in this video. But we're just going to see what this other one is. <sighs> Thank you, God. Thank you, God. See, I saw off the corner of my eye a little bit of yellow. I didn't know if that was Simpsons or not, but this was what it was. So we Bart, we, Bart, we got Bartigula. And this is perfect because I'm collecting this, this set. I already have Marjora. I don't know how, you, how you're supposed to say it, but I got Marge. Then you got Emperor Montemus, which is Mr. Burns. Lysandra, which is Lisa, and Obesis is Homer. So now I got two for the set. So awesome. Really, really awesome. Um, and of course you get... Oh! Okay, these ones are worth it in general. You get two scratch-offs. Which, if you guys don't know, use it for points and all that junk. Oh, wow. I didn't give you double the candy. This is actually my first time getting a Crybaby one, so that's cool. And we got banana and tropical flavored lollipops. So that's cool. But, um, yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. I'm going to make this a four-parter. I think it's fun. This was a good first box. But, um, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. And I shall see you guys in the next one.